Hi guys, Ash here and this is my review of the Alliance ROM for the Galaxy Note GT N7000. Uh, this ROM is based on Android 4.0.4, that's Ice Cream Sandwich. Um, and a lot of modifications have been done with this ROM guys uh, and let's go ahead and quickly take a look at it. Guys, the first thing you're going to notice about this ROM is the S3 kind of uh, the ripple lock screen. It's a nice add-on. Uh, you also get three different launchers, the Nova Launcher, TouchPress Home and TW Launcher. TouchPress Home is the Galaxy S3 uh, style launcher with these kind of uh, transitions. Uh, the TW Launcher is Galaxy Note 4.0.4 Ice Cream Sandwich Launcher. And uh, you also get the third party Nova Launcher as well. Uh, all three are pretty smooth and have no issues uh, as far as launchers go. Enough going quickly into TouchPress Home. So yeah. Uh, guys, the notification bar has also been worked on. Uh, you get your brightness controls from here and you also get a lot of uh, toggles over here. Easy access to the settings. And your ice cream sandwich swipe to uh, close notifications work. As far as open apps go, you get the sense kind, sense kind of open apps. Uh, like this. It stutters once in a while. A very minimal stutter, nothing that's going to affect your usage but just letting you guys know and then you also have your task manager and a remove all button so that's pretty default uh, one more one more thing I like about this ROM is the fonts guys now if going into display and going into fonts you have a lot of fonts that have been added and since there are a lot of fonts it just it does take a few seconds to actually open up uh, I'll just show you in a second So as you can see there are over 80 fonts added so that's a welcome addition and again guys uh, as far as SMS go uh, instead of uh, SMS by default getting converted to MMS after 4 pages uh, the setting has been changed to 100 pages before your SMS gets converted to MMS the ringtone has also been, also been switched from uh, I mean the ascending part of the ringtone has been taken off you get your full ringtone at full volume the moment it hits uh, the there is also an inbuilt call recorder function uh, and SMS and MMS have also been removed from the call logs guys S voice has also been ported over but then again there are some issues with it uh, I couldn't get talk back to work and uh, it freezes a lot so I would definitely not recommend you flashing this ROM just to get S voice because S voice is very very quirky at this moment the Play Store works fine without any issues uh, since this is 4.0.4 there is no Google Now as well but if you want Google Now we can always flash it I've got a tutorial to do that uh, and I've added the uh, link to Google Now in the description so go ahead get that done your 4.0.4 pop-up player works no issues with that as well just to show you that's the pop-up player works pretty well no issues with that now closing it uh, your, your signature unlock is also present and face, un face unlock works as well, no issues. Just quickly going into settings here, security and screen lock. You've got signature, face unlock, all the options there. Uh, the S Pen works guys, uh, your S Node and S Memo are present as well. So works fine, no lag, no issues with that as, as well. And as far as taking a screenshot and other features go, uh, they work fine as well. So no issues with S Pen. The keyboard has also been, uh, you know, uh, modified a bit, and I like the way uh, these keys are placed, and I like the way that the keyboard looks. Just wanted to let you guys know. Uh, you also get Allianz OTA which means you can uh, get kernels and modems and wood animations packages and a lot of stuff right from uh, right from the what do you say from the phone you don't have to actually manually download the packages and go to clockwork mod and flash it you can use the Allianz OTA app instead 
As far as connectivity goes guys, there are no issues, uh, again, uh, Wi-Fi works fine, 3G works fine, uh, the hotspot features wor works as well, and um, as far as Bluetooth goes, again, uh, pretty stable, no issues with that as well. Uh, just to show you, let me quickly open up the music player, and uh, play something, going back. So AVRCP works, skipping tracks, pausing, play, and the, uh, the connectivity is pretty strong, no issues there as well. One of the most important uh, things when it comes to any ROM is the battery life, and the battery life here is pretty decent as well. Uh, I've not really used the phone, so the two days, 11 hours, you're not probably going to get this kind of battery life. But anything around a day or a little more than that is very, very easily possible with a little more than moderate usage as well. That is a few hours of Bluetooth uh, streaming, music, music an hour or a little less than that of video playback, uh, gaming and uh, connected to Wi-Fi all the time. Uh, anything around a day or a little more than a day is definitely possible as far as battery life goes. This ROM is very very good and uh, as far as the camera goes guys again you it works fine no issues at all uh, 8 megapixel shots without any issues 1080p 720p works fine and uh, switching from back to front cameras works good as well not too much of a delay just the regular delay that you get that's that's it when it comes to camera Checking the boot time now. Uh, the boot animation also has also been reworked on. Uh, this is the Allianz boot, um, boot animation. The boot sound has also been changed. So that was about 24 seconds for boot, which is pretty decent. So now moving on to uh, benchmarks, let me quickly run a full benchmark on Quadrant Standard. Three thousand seventy-three. Of moving on to and two two. So there you have it guys, 6,442. So that's pretty much it guys when it comes to the review of the uh, Allianz ROM for the Galaxy Note and uh, GDN7000. If you guys have any questions, leave it in the comment section or you guys can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter. Or you can email me directly, all my contact details are in the description. Uh, and before you go guys, make sure you hit the like and subscribe buttons. I will be coming out with more videos for the Galaxy Note and uh, you know other devices that I can get my hands on. Um, and if you guys do want to do me a favor, use my links to Amazon in the description. Uh, just go through my links and you know you can order whatever you want. If there's anything you want to order online and if you could do it off Amazon, uh, you could use my links to get to Amazon. And uh, the prices remain the same for you. It's just that if you go through my links and you, you end up purchasing anything, I tend to make a few cents to a few bucks on every order placed. Uh, it doesn't have to necessarily be Galaxy Note or smartphone related stuff, it could be anything, just go through the links and use the search bar, that's pretty much it. 
So uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys, and uh, I'll see you guys soon. Till then, you guys have a great day. Bye bye now.